This free AI tool just broke the internet by signing up over a million users in less than a week. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get signed up for it and exactly how to use it. This website slash AI tool will write a book for you, write papers for you. It could do your job. It will write code, create art. It's truly amazing. I think you'll spend a few minutes on it and your mind will be blown. Just to put it in perspective, it took Facebook almost a year to get a million followers and it took the iPhone almost three months and this AI tool just did it in seven days. Let's jump on the computer and I'll show you how to get signed up. Okay, let's jump into it. We're here at Google and you're just going to type in chat and then GPT. And from here, it's going to show you the openai.com. Just click on that. It's going to take you here. And what you're going to do is scroll down and try chat GPT. Now, when you click on this, it'll ask you for an email and password. Once you enter that, you'll have to confirm your email. And then it'll also ask you for a phone number and it'll shoot you a text with a confirmation. Once you get through that, then what's going to happen is it's going to take you to chat GPT. Now, what this can do, it, it really, it's amazing. For instance, right here, I'm just going to type in here, write a YouTube script for the top five YouTube creator tools. And literally, it's going to write a YouTube script for me. It'll write scripts, it'll write papers, blog posts, it'll answer any questions that you have. Literally, it's endless. I'm, I'm curious, leave a comment down below what you think you'll use this for the most. It, it might even be able to do your job. But just to give you an idea while it's writing here, there's also, and you'll see this in your email, there's a frequently asked questions uh, section. If you go back to this main site here, it's good to kind of look around in here. And what I really liked was this user guide right here. I'll go back up to the top and it just kind of goes through an overview of all the different things that you can do, how to put things in it. It even has what's called a playground. So for instance, right here, write a tagline for an ice cream shop. Um, right here is a playground where I can just ask simple questions like, uh, give me an idea for a name of a flower shop. That's better. And then I click submit here and it'll give me some answers. This is kind of like their toolbox or quote unquote playground, but it is limited to characters. And over here, there's what's called a temperature and that will lower the randomness of the results that it's giving you, especially if it's giving you um, results that you don't like. But there's all of these different things that you can use here. And once again, this is only a week old, so still kind of playing around and learning it. But the main part is right here. But look at that. It just gave me an outline for a video. And I could literally, like here, um, create a poem of a frog, not a from, a frog on a lily pad, for instance, right? And then I just click here and then it's going to take a moment and then it's going to create that. Now, keep in mind, if you go to sign up for this and you keep getting uh, just the screen is kind of frozen, if you're doing this during the middle of the day, I don't think they ever expected to have a million users in the first week. So I think the website might be getting a little bit overwhelmed. Right now it's 4 a.m. and I'm creating this video. I wanted to do it early so I could make sure that I could get access to this. Uh, but I'm sure that'll get worked out in the next few days. But this tool is just unbelievable. So once again, leave that comment down below what you think you would use this for or any questions that you have for me. And I think this is going to revolutionize content creation and much, much more.